Topic 8, Early Childhood Physical Development, examines the changes in a child's body and brain between two and six years old. During this period, the child grows taller and thinner, with variations depending on genes, nutrition, income, and ethnicity. We'll discover that children are naturally picky eaters with small appetites, but that many parents tend to overfeed their children, thinking it's better or healthier. We'll chart brain growth during this period as the brain reaches 90% of its adult weight by age five. Neurons send messages at faster and faster speeds with the process of myelination. So the child's actions and reactions speed up. We'll also study the rapid development of the prefrontal cortex, which gives the child the ability to think before acting. The limbic system, which includes the amygdala, the hippocampus, and the hypothalamus, also matures during this time, helping with emotional control and expression of feelings. We'll see how the development of motor skills turns a clumsy two-year-old into a well-coordinated six-year-old. Fine motor skills are more difficult to master, but we'll see youngsters learning through art by coloring and drawing. We'll discuss how the environment affects motor development. For instance, how a lack of play space may hinder motor skill development, or how high levels of pollutants such as lead might affect the growing brain. We'll end topic eight considering the injuries and abuse that can occur during these early years. Accidents are the leading cause of mortality for children in developed countries, and close supervision is required to keep them safe. But abuse, the intentional maltreatment of a child, is also a huge problem, with three million cases reported in the U.S. each year. Physical abuse is the most overt form, but neglect is far more common and perhaps even more harmful. So let's explore how a child grows from a toddler to a thoughtful and coordinated young person.